So I keep two Bokashi buckets here. Typically the bottom one is empty so that when the top one is full, I've got one easily accessible. And then I've got two, one more over there and then there's one in the backyard that needs to come back in. I've got my gamma lid, keeps it airtight. This is not necessary, this is an airscape lid. Okay, and so because I know I'm gonna be adding something that's like wet with the coleslaw, I'm gonna go ahead and put the bread bites and some of the pizza in. I went ahead and broke the piece, uh, pizza up into pieces that are ideally not larger than the palm of my hand. Okay, so I have something that's gonna absorb the liquid of the coleslaw. I really overestimated how much coleslaw we would eat. Okay. All right, so I've got a two to three inch layer of food in here now. So now it's time to add the Bokashi brand, which I just keep in a little airtight container right here. Just a little, I'm gonna do a sprinkle. And it's time to add a lasagna. All right, so the great thing about Bokashi, so this has meat in it but I can add it to the bakashi because when you bakashi ferment your food before adding it to the compost, you can feel confident about composting meat and dairy and cooked foods and oily foods. So this obviously is a cooked food and it has dairy. God, it was so good. I can't believe we didn't get to eat it all. And I just, I never feel horrible like I used to about wasting food when I can bokashi it all because it's it's not wasted. If it's not going in the trash, it's not wasted. It's going to make compost and feed my garden. We have zero food going in our trash can. Film one-handed while getting the dough out. So, all right. I think I'm gonna go ahead and seal this bucket up. So I'm gonna do a generous sprinkle of the bokashi brand on the top. And then I'm gonna put the gamma lid on. And this bucket's gonna sit for two to three weeks in my garage until it's fermented and ready to go in, in the compost. I'm gonna prep the empty bucket so that the next time I have food scraps that need to come out, it's ready. And I'm just going to take some of the Bokashi, like a good layer. So I do a good layer at the very bottom and at the very top. All right, and then I'll put my airscape lid in, just waiting for the next time that I add food scraps. And that is how I Bokashi.